Okay, so this is going to be probably a pretty quick video. <laughs> we're just graphing a horizontal and then we're going to graph a vertical line. The thing is you have to remember which one's which. So when it's y equals a number, that's going to be the horizontal one. So you go to negative 4, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, and you're just going to draw a horizontal line and put the arrows on the end, and it's graphed. And that's how you graph the line y equals negative 4 in the rectangular coordinate system. Okay? Uh, you could remember it's the y-intercept being at negative 4. That might help. Or think about the table of values we talked about in the last video. All right, now we're going to graph this linear equation, x equals 2. Well, in other words, we're graphing every place where the points are x equals 2. So you're talking about having an x of 2 here, an x of 2 here. This is like 2, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3. All of those points, and it's making a vertical line. Or you can just remember when it's x, like the x games, you know, skiing off the cliff. <laughs> anyway, I don't know if that helps, but it it's um, a vertical line. It's not a function, but that's how you graph it, x equals 2.